Now students let's understand about subtraction and addition of mixed fractions. So we have a mixed fraction here you can see 4 5 by 6 minus 2 3 by 8 plus 3 7 by 12. So we have to subtract also and there is some addition part also. So first we will change this mixed fraction into a proper fraction that is 6 into 4 plus 5 by 6 it can be written as then this can be written as 8 into 2 plus 3 by 8 that is minus from this and plus 3 into 12 plus 7 here you can see by divided by 12 so it will come out as 29 by 6 minus 19 by 8 plus 43 by 12 where all of these are actually improper fractions last class you have studied this then when you have to add these or add or subtract these you can see the denominators are not common in each of these so we cannot do by the method which we have studied just now so what we have to do we have to do just like we studied the method for addition of two fractions with uncommon denominators we have to do a similar method here so you see we have to take LCM of 6, 8 and 12 I have taken here LCM you can see LCM of 6, 8 and 12 so I think you know how to take the LCM so LCM of 6, 8 and 12 comes at 2 into 3 into 2 into 2 that is 24 so now I can convert my these fractions I can convert into fractions of this form with common denominators by using this method which you have already done for addition so 29 into 4 by 6 into 4 it will be 116 by 24 19 into 3 by 8 into 3 it will be 57 by 24 43 into 2 divided by 12 into 2 will be 86 by 24 so in each of these cases you see 116 by 24 57 by 24 and 86 by 24 they have the same denominator that is 24 in each case so I can write down that common denominator 24 so 116 minus 57 plus 86 divided by 24 it will come out as 145 by 24 so my addition and subtraction of these mixed fractions that is 4 5 by 6 minus 2 3 by 8 plus 3 7 by 12 it is equal to 145 by 24 so I hope you have understood this subtraction and addition of mixed fractions.